Okay, this is one whole bunch of celery and three medium onions and about a quarter bag of a one pound bag of, well, a quarter pound of carrots to, this is like a eight quart, I think, stock pot. Just uh, cover it with water, put your giblets in there, a stick of butter. I use a uh, half teaspoon of rosemary, um, about two heaping tablespoons of sage, dried sage, and uh, just a dash of Italian seasoning just to make it a little bit more herbaceous. You cook this till it's tender. Then you take the giblets out. If you want to use the giblets, um, I do. I chop them up and uh, put them in one of my stuffings. It's the one my son likes with the meat-based one. But the um, basic stuffing recipe begins with just this. And then the one that you want to make, you would uh, put this in fairly warm not too hot to where you're going to get burnt but you want to put it into the croutons hot then um, dice up your apple peel it dice it add your cranberries add your nuts and you have to toast your nuts do not use untoasted nuts remember that well, you add your nuts, then you add two eggs, scrambled, and then you mix it into the stuffing and you bake it for 45 minutes to an hour, depending on how you like your stuffing. I, my crew likes it, um, take the cover off of it and let the top get a little bit crusty, or you can even put it into the cavity of the bird, but you have to follow those safety guidelines, which I suggest you Google. Alrighty. So that's it. Did I say a half stock or a whole stock? This is a whole stock. I suggest a whole stock if you're going to use two boxes. And I think for 10 people, you should use two boxes if you want leftovers. One box would be stretching it. But you got little kids, so I don't know. Use your best judgment, but this is how I do it. I hope you have a happy Thanksgiving.